Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy, and today's quick tip is an Adobe Audition CC 2020. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to normalize audio. The normalization effect will be applied in the waveform view of Adobe Audition. If you are working in the multi-track and you want to normalize an audio track, all you need to do is just double click on the track and that will open up into the waveform view where you can normalize the audio. The first way to normalize audio in the waveform view of Adobe Audition is to come up to the favorites menu. There are two options, normalize to minus 0.1 dB. This is gonna be the loudest or normalize to minus 3 dB. I typically normalize to minus 3 dB. And if you go back into the multi-track, the normalization will be applied. The second way to apply the normalization effect is to come up to the effects menu, go to amplitude and compression, and select normalize process. Click on that. You have the option to normalize to a percentage or to DB. I'm gonna recommend clicking on the DB, click on this value and just enter in a value. I'm gonna type in minus three. So I get normalize to minus three DB, the same as we did in the favorites menu. I'll click on apply. Audition will amplify the entire audio file in proportion and the loudest peak will not go above minus three dB. So now you know how to apply the normalization effect and now I wanna make sure you understand what is happening. So I'm gonna to go to amplitude statistics. I'm gonna click on scan. This is gonna tell me what the loudest part of this audio file is. So if I look here, peak amplitude, I can see that the highest point of this audio file is currently at minus 9.31. I wanna bring all of the levels up proportionally and I want the loudest peak to not go above minus three dB. So I'm gonna apply the normalization effect. You can do it on the effects menu by going here or you can go to the favorites menu. I'm just gonna select normalize to minus three dB. I'll click on that. If I go back to amplitude statistics and click on scan again, I can now see that the peak amplitude is minus three. And if you are a podcaster, you typically normalize the audio early on in the post-production process before you apply equalization or compression. And it's really good if you have a low recording and you just wanna bring everything up so it's easier to hear everything. My name is Mike Murphy, and that is how you normalize audio in Adobe Audition CC 2020. Cheers.